In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issues on the Call of Duty website where you can't log in with your PlayStation 4 account. And this is fixed using Microsoft Edge. So if you have a Mac, then this tutorial is not for you. So Microsoft Edge is a Windows browser. Most people use Chrome, but Chrome is causing problems for some reason. So once you open Microsoft Edge, you want to click on the three dots here, go to settings. And the first settings that you want to search for here on the top is pop-up. Then you go to pop-ups and redirects. And then you want to make sure that this is to the left, not like that. And then under the allow websites, you want to put this link here and then add a secondary link below that. Once you add those two links then the next thing you want to search for is history under history you want to click on clear browsing data now and click this blue button here and make sure that you select the all time and this is going to basically erase all of your history okay once you do that go ahead and close your browser and open microsoft edge again and head over to the Call of Duty website. And then from here, you could put a full screen and then you're gonna see the login button here on the top. Now go ahead and click on the PS4 or the PlayStation icon. It's gonna redirect you to the Sony login. So you go ahead and put in your email, click next and then put in your password. Most people are having issues at this screen where it hangs and it never proceeds to the next step, but this should fix it and you should be able to log in and it should ask you to set up the two-factor authentication if you don't have it set up. And then you could click on skip for now. So now your name should show up here on the top and most people are just trying to link the account. So you could basically click on linked accounts now and it should populate here in a second. So once you click on link the account, now you could go ahead and link your accounts as desired. All right, well, I hope this fixes it for you. If you have any questions, issues, leave your comment below and please subscribe.